Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, Angel Liz. So how is everybody doing today? I hope that everybody has had a great day. It is Mukbang Saturday. Hope everybody's weekend is going well. So you guys, today I have Chick-fil-A. I have a deluxe chicken sandwich and I have some nuggets. And I'm not gonna eat all these, it's like a 30 count. And I have some waffle fries and Today, you guys, I'm going to be reviewing the tiger sauce. So you guys, without any further ado, let's get into this food because I don't want my food to get cold and I have a Chick-fil-A lemonade. I don't want my food to get cold. I hate, 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 hate cold food. Sorry, I put my everything next to me. So, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go ahead and move these up here, but I'm gonna move this. Cause I don't really know that I wanna eat that just yet. Mmm. Mm hmm. Mmm. Sorry, I'm hungry. Okay. And so this is gonna be. I did try a little bit, but I feel like with stuff like this, you should try it on chicken. You know, let me shake it up. So what has everybody been up to besides trying to keep up with this nonsense YouTube drama? pretty good okay but I don't want to pour it all over all of my nuggets mm. okay okay tiger sauce okay it's hot but it's not like um I don't want to say it. It's hot, but it's not like excessive heat. But it is, it is a little spicy. Mmm. Mm-hmm. I don't know why they call these nuggets because they like bites. They should call them chicken bites because these ain't nuggets. These are the, well, I guess nuggets are supposed to be small. Let me stop being greedy. Mmm, okay. Mm hmm. Okay. That's pretty good, y'all. I like it. But I'm gonna go ahead and, um,. I am gonna eat my sandwich because I don't like soggy bread. <sighs> so, I have to put ranch on my sandwich. So, y'all, I'm so disappointed in the mukbang community because it's like are y'all mukbangers or gangbangers and the reason i say that is because y'all really going hard on certain people within the community and it's like it's kind of crazy my thing is is like people make mistakes move on you know, nobody's perfect. Everybody makes mistakes. Move on from it. But y'all out here like, like set tripping, <laughs> straight set tripping. And here's the thing, you know, 
things can happen sometimes and over time details can be forgotten you know names can be forgotten you know but the thing is is that I feel like don't ever discredit someone's feelings. Like don't ever dismiss someone's feelings and say, well, that didn't happen. They lying and they just want to feel some type of way. Don't do that. Own up to what you did wrong and apologize. Because here's the thing. Maybe the person felt like they couldn't say something back when it happened. You know, I don't know. I don't want to pick sides. I just want everybody to stop tripping and to get along. I know that's naive of me to think that everybody will get along because some people just aren't going to like each other, but... I feel like to just continue to go in and just to continue to talk about it and and to keep fighting is too much. So I just, you know, I just want everybody to get along. And if you can't get along, leave it alone and stop talking about each other at least. Um, everybody clout chases at some point. Everybody wants to grow their channel. And unfortunately, some people's tactics are not, are not the best. They ain't doing it the right way. But... Don't call somebody a cloud chaser and then turn around and do the exact same thing that they did. And I'm I'm not dogging anybody out. I'm just saying, like, you can't say, well, so-and-so is a cloud chaser. They're doing videos on so-and-so every day. But then you turning around and you kind of doing the same thing, so... Agree to disagree and move on because everybody is on here for a purpose. Rather it be to make money, to gain success, fame, whatever it is, you, you're on YouTube for a purpose. And while some people are grimy, you don't have to be grimy. And I feel like There's always going to be grimy people out there no matter what. But we don't have to stoop to their level and be grimy like them. And as far as like the people, what people want to call the drama channels, listen. Everybody knows that drama sells. <laughs> That's why. Sorry, y'all. Uh, I lick my fingers sometimes. That's why we have Real Housewives of Atlanta. That's why we have Basketball Wives. That's why we have Love and Hip Hop Hollywood, Love and Hip Hop Miami, Love and Hip Hop New York. Um, what else? Black Ink Crew, Black Ink Crew Chicago. <laughs> we got everything, every franchise under the sun. So, and what, what do they bring to the table? What do they really bring to the table? They bring drama because that's what some people like to see. A lot of people like to see it. That's why these shows are so successful. And truth be told, on YouTube, a lot of the drama channels do very well. A lot of the gossip vloggers do very well. Their channels are huge. Excuse me. They have a huge subscriber base. They do well because they bring in that drama. Now, is it a bad thing? I don't know. <laughs> I'm not going to say it's a bad thing. I'm going to say that it's, it's what they do. It's their thing. You can't get mad at them for it. If you don't like it, click off. Don't watch it, right? If somebody is doing a video every day about a certain YouTuber and you're tired of seeing it, just don't watch it. 
You don't have to start inserting yourself in the drama and going after people because you, you think you can silence them because you can't. These are adults that are going to do what they want to do. So y'all, anyways, I hope that everybody is, um, you know, staying focused and just, just know that this will pass and then it'll be some more drama next week. So don't even worry about it. It's going to always be something. <laughs> And I might actually finish my sandwich. But please give this video a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe, hit the bell to be notified. Drop me a comment. Let me know if you like the tiger sauce. I like the tiger sauce. Um, let me know what you like to eat it with. And you guys, when I ask you to comment, I really want you to comment. Let me know. What do you like to eat it with? I It's good with chicken. I definitely know it's good with chicken. But you guys, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Thank you to each and every one of you. Those who have subscribed. Those who have watched but haven't subscribed. Those who are thinking about subscribing. I appreciate all the love. And I want everybody to have a great weekend. And I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.